Zoomline Mixer is the result of joint research and development by Zoomline engineers and CIFA engineers. It combines Zoomline's decades of experience in development and production of concrete equipment, featuring world-class efficiency and performance. So how to operate and maintain the mixer properly? Now we will explain from the following five aspects. First, introduction to main components. Zoomline JS series concrete mixer is composed of driving device, linear plate device, mixing device, discharge gate device, shaft end device, lubrication device, mixer cover, mixer shell, and electrical cabinet. First, driving device. Consisting of main mixing motor, motor pulley, reducer pulley, driving belt, synchronous coupler, reducer, spling shaft, main coupler and pulley shield. Second, linear plate device. Mainly consisting of end linear plate and arc linear plate. Third, mixing device. The mixing shaft, mixing arm, mixing blade and well-resisting linear composed of the main mixing body. Fourth, discharge gate device. The discharge gate device is composed of discharge gate main body, oil cylinder, hydraulic unit, and proximity switch. During automatic operation, is usually set as full open, full closed, and half open. Fifth, shaft end device. The shaft end device is composed of bearing support, bearing, seal kit, and lubricating oil line. The lubricating oil line lubricates and seals the parts of the support and the mixing shaft head to ensure that mortar will not corrode the parts of the bearing support and the mixing shaft. 6. Lubrication Device The automatic lubrication system is one of the core devices of the mixer, and its normal operation directly affects the working efficiency and service life of the mixer. The automatic lubrication system is mainly composed of lubrication pump, pump core, safety valve, pressure gauge and filter. 7. Mixer cover The mixer cover is mainly composed of cover main body, access door, safety switch and pipeline system. Its mainly function is for sealing, feeding and observation. 8. Mixer shell the mixer shell is composed of case block and accessories. It's used to accommodate the material's mixture and support various parts. Ninth, electrical cabinet. The electrical cabinet includes emergency stop button and wiring terminals. Second, safety precautions before operation. First, check whether the motor turns in the right direction, mainly after starting a new machine and after electrical maintenance. Second, Check whether the lubrication pump has adequate oil and whether the grease can rarely reach the shaft head. Third, before starting the mixer, check the surrounding of the machine to ensure that the startup of the mixer will not cause casualties. Third, operation procedure. The operation procedure of the mixer are as follows. First, close the discharge gate. Second, start the mixer. Third, feed materials. The suggested feeding sequence is aggregate, water, mineral powder, and fly ash, cement. The fourth, mix materials. In order to avoid overload, observe the current ammeter value of the main motor and adjust the mixing ratio as required to reduce the feeding amount. Fifth, discharge concrete through the discharge gate. The mixer can discharge automatically or manually. 6. After discharging, close the discharge gate. 7. Clean the mixer regularly. When the machine is shut down for more than 30 minutes, high-pressure water flow must be used to clean the inside of the mixer shell and the discharge gate. This can avoid mixer solidification to the most. Clean the mixer before stop for a long time or after work shift. Precautions for cleaning If the mixer is cleaned manually, it's forbidden to remove the mixer remaining with a hammer, because violent impact may damage the mixing blade. It's forbidden to enter the mixer for no reason or without adequate safety measures, which will lead to death or serious injury.
Precaution for operation in winter. First, in winter, the working place of the mixer should be equipped with heating device to keep the room temperature above zero degrees Celsius, and the mixer must be allowed to run idle for at least 30 minutes before work. Second, if the ambient temperature is below this standard, a heater blower must be used to heat the driving device from the outside. How to deal with non-discharge stop or power failure? In case of accidents such as non-discharge stop or power failure, it's forbidden to start a mixer with load. Please use the electric or manual hydraulic pump to open the discharge gate to discharge the materials and then inch the motor. After all the materials in the mixer have been discharged, the main mixer can be restarted normally. The cause of non-discharge stop should be found out and eliminated. Then the production can be continued. Fourth, regular maintenance. First, daily check and maintenance. Whether there is adequate oil in the gearbox, the oil level in the side glass should be more than half. Whether there is adequate oil in the lubrication pump, under normal condition, the grease should be kept half or upper of the tank. Whether there is adequate oil in the hydraulic power unit of the discharge gate, the oil quantity in the side glass should be more than half. Check whether the current value of the main motor is normal. Check the pressure of the lubrication pump. Ensure the rotation direction of lubrication pump is right. The power range of four gauges is between 2 to 10 mp. And there are no less than two swings per minute. Run the machine without load for 30 minutes. Then check the inner wall of the main mixer, and there should be grease overflow at the shaft end. Second, weekly check and maintenance. Check whether the locking bolts of all mixing blades and mixing arms are loose. Check and adjust the distance between mixing vein and corresponding linear plate. The distance is about 5 mm. Fill enough grease into the grease caps on the rotating part. Number 3, lithium grease is recommended. Check the V-bells, adjust or replace them if necessary. Third, monthly check and maintenance. Check the wear of side leaners and bottom leaners. When the wear exceeds 40%, replacement is required. Check the wear of mixing veins. When the wear exceeds 35%, replacement is required. Check whether the locking bolts of the discharge gate shaft and bearing support are loose. Check whether the locking bolts of the motor cabinet are loose. Fourth, yearly check and maintenance. It's required to completely replace the gear oil of the reducer. The heavy duty gear oil should be replaced after the first 200 hours of first month. After that, the heavy duty gear oil should be replaced every 2000 hours or every half a year. The industrial gear oil 150 is recommended. Check the wear and leakage of the seals of the mix shaft heads and decide whether to replace the spare parts of the sealing system. Precautions for lubrication system maintenance First, the grease must be injected into the oil tank through the filter with a refueling gun. It's forbidden to open the upper cover of the oil pump of refueling, otherwise the pump core will be damaged. Second, Oil for automatic lubrication system. Number two, lithium grease can be used for environment temperature above 10 degrees Celsius, and number one, lithium grease can be used for environment temperature below 10 degrees Celsius. Third, after each oil injection, the quick coupling of the filter must be covered with a protective sleeve. Fourth, the filter screen of the filter should be cleaned with diesel oil every three months, or the filter screen should be replaced. Fifth, common faults and solutions. First, leakage at shaft end. Main causes. First, use of wrong grease. Second, insufficient oil supply of lubrication system. Solution, replace the sealing device at the shaft end. Inspect and repair the lubrication system. Second, abnormal noise at shaft end. Main cause, bearing damage caused by untimely lubrication. Solution: Replace the damaged bearing, inspect and repair the lubrication system. Third, lubrication pump does not work. 
main causes. First, mechanical damage such as pump body failure. Solution: Replace the pump body. Second, electrical failure. Solution: Repair the electrical circuit or replace the fuse. Fourth, the lubrication pump works but does not produce lubricating oil. Main causes: First, there is not enough oil in the tank. Solution: Fill the lubricating oil as required. Second, there is air in the grease. Solution: The lubrication pump works for about 10 minutes and then the oil can be discharged normally. Third, the pump core fails. Solution: Replace the pump core. Fifth, the discharge gate is not working smoothly. Main causes: First, the hydraulic system is short of oil and the pressure is too low. Solution: Refill the hydraulic oil and adjust the main pressure. Second, the proximity switch is damaged. Solution: Replace with the proximity switch of the same model. Third, the discharge gate is stuck. Solution: Clean the accumulated materials around the discharge gate. Zoom Line 4.0 mixer features efficient and energy-saving mixing, dual mixing vanes, simple and safe operation, as well as other advantages. It's well received by users. A good product can fully demonstrate its performance and value only under proper operation and maintenance.